what it do, y'all? Well, <laughs> out of orientation with a nice, clean, pretty truck and a nice, clean, pretty trailer. And this is what I had to come to. First load. Uh, if y'all can't tell, y'all might think them laws. I mean, law, them pipes, man. Steel pipe time, man. Got this load. Uh, Hewitt Town. Might as well still say Birmingham. Same thing. Right down the street. Uh, it's headed to Houston, Texas, man. $1,500 load, man. I get my little 27%. And that $1,500 can actually go up depending on how much they weigh. So that's a good thing, man. Say the more it weigh, the more the load pay. So if I can get away with it legally, you can go and throw the whole 48000 on me. I'm trying to get it mud bread as I possibly can, especially on the third load, man. But yeah, of course I got here <laughs> 1145, do the waiting to get all my equipment. So I got here, got pulled to the back, and of course they went on lunch. So I got 30 minutes before I get loaded, man. I know y'all probably wonder who is this guy with? Who who is he picking this load up for? Well, I will have the answer in a little bit, man. So y'all sit back, stay tuned, back on the grind. It's your boy, Chris the Truck. Well, y'all heard the announcement. If you seen the opening credit, eight years, your boy is officially PNS transportation truck driver, 2020 freight liner. I gotta get used to this freight liner, man. It do not drive like the Peterbilt or the K-Dub. I think I get used to it, man. I got brand new everything, man. Seemed like a good company. I know when I started with Mel, man, I ain't had nothing brand new. My car's even in pretty decent shape. I don't think they brand new, brand new, but they ain't, they ain't that old, neither. Brand new trailer that they just had got on the uh, lot. The, the straps ain't brand new, but the trailer is. Yeah, man. Ready to roll, man. 48 footers. I can tell the difference already. I can definitely tell the difference between 48 and 53. <laughs> a little bit easier to maneuver around, especially in old downtown Birmingham. I had to come out of, man. But yeah, man. This is it. We starting a new chapter. And we starting with PNS transportation. I'ma jump back in the cab, man. I'ma wait for these guys to go and eat their lunch. And I'ma get back with y'all, man. So y'all sit back and stay tuned, man. I'ma try to get as much footage as I can. If it start bad raining, it's gonna be a wrap. It's been pouring off and on all day, man. But y'all sit back and stay tuned, man. PNS, baby.
deal, y'all. <laughs> it's a done deal, man. Nasty day for first load, man. Yeah, man. Uh, <laughs> in and out, though. Didn't have to wait. Well, other than the 30 minutes I had to wait for uh, them to get back off the lunch, I really didn't have to wait for them to load me up. Didn't take that long. Got me in, got me out. I'm loving the straps on the trailer already. <laughs> loving that, man, loving that. It just seems like it cuts a lot of time down. Oh, I strapping a load. But I will be honest though, I did uh kind of get, uh <laughs> I kind of messed up on a couple of them, I forgot to go through the rock rail. I guess I was so used to hooking it and then going through the rub rail, but I forgot to do a couple of them through the rub rail. So I had to take them off and run them back through the rub rail. Eh, wasn't nothing, wasn't nothing too uh, major, you know. Uh, a little quick fix, so yeah. He says one, two, three. Nothing to it, man. Nothing to it. Uh, I actually don't have a yard move on here. So I might need to call my DM about. I know they said something about it on uh, in uh, orientation. I don't have one on my Qualcomm, and I desperately need one. I'm not trying to keep on my drive time, even though I am going home and I got seven hours and 26 minutes left, and only got four hours till I get home. So technically, I could if I wanted to. I guess it's just out of habit. Uh, don't want to turn the drive line on. Yeah. Uh, trying to creep up here. Go get my paperwork, man. We gonna be on the road, man. I'll sit back, stay tuned. Out there, 
say y'all stay safe. It's your boy Chris Trump. Until next time. I'm just a ghetto child trying to make it.